I'm your friend Takshir Yadav. Welcome back to my channel Takshir Yadav. Today I'm going to share with you the cubic polynomial trick which can be very helpful and can help you in solving the cubic polynomials in less than 10 seconds. So let's start. This is our first example here. So first of all we'll find the first zero with hit and, hit and trial method. Take a look at the constant. Here the constant is 20. What are the factors of 20? Well, they are plus minus 1, plus minus 2, plus minus 3, plus minus 4, I'm sorry, plus minus 5, plus minus 10, and plus minus 20. Okay? Yep. Now, if you take a look carefully, you'll find that all the signs here are positive. So, there is no use taking positive values. So, I'll start with the negative value, negative 1. Let's start. I'll take the value as negative 1. Okay. Putting x as negative 1, I get negative 1 cube plus 13 into negative 1 square plus 32 into negative 1 plus 20. Let's solve it. It is equal to minus 1 minus, sorry, it is positive 13 as minus 1 square gives us 1, minus 32 and plus 20. Hey, take a look. This gives us 0, which means that minus 1 is a 0 of the cubic polynomial x cubed plus 13x squared plus 32x plus 20. So, our first factor is x plus 1. Okay? Now we have to find the remaining two factors. For that, I'll use the magic cross method which I have already shared with you in the previous video. So let's see that method. But before of, before that, we'll have to use something else. Now let's continue. Here, do you remember that the factor was x plus 1 and the 0 was negative 1, right? So here I'll write negative 1 and the line and another line. And here, what is the coefficient of x cubed? That is 1. 13 x squared, it is 13. 32 x, it is 32. And the last is, is same, 20. Now, bring it down, it is 1. Multiply it. Minus 1 into 1 gives us negative 1. Add them, it gives us 12. Negative 12, 20 negative 20 okay so at last we get zero take a look and this becomes our quadratic polynomial here it is x square plus 12 x plus 20 okay now we'll use the magic cross to find its factors one and one here four and five do we fit four x five x nine x no don't. Then what other factors can we use? Well, the factors are 2 and 10. Right? So I'll use 2 and 10. Here it goes 2x, 10x, positive, positive, same signs here. X, now the factors are x plus 2 and x plus 10. And do you remember that our first factor was x plus 1? So these three are the factors of this cubic polynomial x cubed plus 13x squared plus 32x plus 20. Have a look. 